Oh, I think it just really hit me that this is like my first video since I reached a million and it's like, I'm kind of a little bit overwhelmed. Let's just start putting makeup on. So hi to all the new people and a big hello and a huge thank you to you guys who've been here for this whole time. So many of you were messaging me saying you've been subscribed for like years. I've been doing this for eight years now and so many of you were saying you've been pretty much subscribed since the start. So I couldn't do it without you guys commenting and liking and sharing with your friends. You guys are just so amazing and so incredible, so thank you. To all the new people out there, my name is Sinead. Using my favorite primer, by the way. I live in Ireland. That's kind of where I created my channel. And I live in here in Cork. Lovely Cork. I'm gonna be using this Naked Skin One and Done. So yeah, I've been doing YouTube now for eight years. It's like such a huge chunk of my life. And I didn't even start to kind of do YouTube, you know? Like I started just to get into college, but it ended up becoming pretty much my job. I do want to start doing some classes as well, especially because YouTube just isn't the same as it used to be. It's a very difficult world to be part of. I think YouTube has kind of made things a little difficult for new people coming in, and it's definitely made it difficult for people who have been here this whole time. All of the Blink Canvas brushes today, I always get asked what brushes I use, and they're my favorite ones. This concealer is just one of my new favorites. Like, it's an old favorite, but like, it's a new favorite as well. The Maybelline Eraser Eye, it is just so so good. Like, look at that. If you've been here for a long time, you know that I do this every single time. I am so obsessed with powder foundation. This is the L'Oreal True Match Mineral. It's the loose powder one. Gives your skin the most beautiful glow. And even on my dry skin, it seems to work. Gonna blend that out with an F36. Base is on. Feel a little bit normal now. A few months ago, I actually wanted to quit YouTube altogether. I literally just erase and delete everything that I do online and just forget that side of my life. And it was nothing that anything was happening. Like there was a lot of positivity and all that, but I was just putting so much pressure on myself like every single day thinking you need to do this, you need to do that. When you look at other people and you think, wow, look at all that they're achieving. And then you look at your own life and you're like, how come I'm not doing all of this stuff? And I'm just failing at everything in my life. Like I just felt like everything was going wrong and I couldn't get anything to go right again. And I remember it was like a Sunday night and I work on Mondays and I just cried and I just was hysterical crying. My mom was like, what's going on? And I was like, I really don't want to go to work. And that has never happened to me because I've always loved doing my job. So to think that that was not that long ago that I was struggling so much and now here we are at the million mark that things do improve, they can improve. And I just wanted to kind of put that out there to you guys because I know that if you're in different industries, you're gonna have that moment where things just aren't going right and you end up feeling like a failure. Just wait it out, I promise you. Just wait it out and you can do it. And even if it takes you down a different path, maybe that was the path you were always supposed to go down. Just applying a little bit of primer on the lids. I'm actually starting a new series on Monday and it's gonna be all about the eyes. So, so far we've done like perfect base and how to create the flawless base if you haven't seen that already. But next Monday we're gonna be starting all about the eyes. I found this really cool hack for beginners when it comes to eye makeup, which I'm really excited to share. So I'm just using the Blank Canvas Master Series Palette. Let me know what your kind of favorite palettes are. Are you doing your makeup right now? Like what are you guys up to? So next month is the beauty show which I'm so excited about. I'm gonna be there with Blank Canvas again. I've met so many of you time and time again, and I get really excited at the shows because I know I'm gonna see you guys again. I'm really looking forward to it. Let's move on to eyeliner. I'm not gonna wing it out because I just don't think I suit a wing. My friends always laugh at me because of the way that I hold my eyeliner, because look at that. Why do I do this? And then on my waterline, I'm just gonna use this eyeliner. This is a really good one. It's the Smoky Black one by Eyes of Horus. Just glides on the eyes so easily. You don't want to leave it like this. Mimic what you've done on the top here in your crease underneath. So use the black as sort of a guide and then just softly blend everything out. Okay, we're nicely smudged. Time for lashes next. Need lots of mascara. I've been probably using this mascara more than any other one. I like how it makes my lashes really soft. So now trying out these new lashes. They're the new ones by Kiss. They're the kind of more luxurious range. So as always, I'm going to apply my lashes underneath and push them up. Let's move on to the face. I'm gonna be using this new palette, which I showed you guys over on Instagram yesterday. Isn't it just the most gorgeous palette? So for the blush, I think we're gonna mix both of the shades together. Some contouring as well. I'm gonna use this brush for contouring. This is the 33. I love these two shades because they have different tones. This is a nice light kind of beige, and then this has almost like a red undertone. I need a little bit of baking at the moment. My face is kind of swollen. I'm gonna take my light powders. I'm gonna sharpen this up. 
Do you ever forget to brush this off? Because sometimes I do forget and I'll look back at a video and I'm like, I totally forgot to take the powder off. Cappuccino by Rimmel. Am I right? It is just one of the best ones. And then this. Oh, I've been obsessed with this color. It's like a brown gray. I love it. Actually remember to brush it off this time. So that is me pretty much done. And I just want to say a huge thank you to everybody. Honestly, your kindness and support. I just, I am just always just blown away by it, honestly. There's two other people, well, one person and one group of people that I have to say a special thank you to as well. Sarah, Makeup by Sad, for sticking with me and having so many adventures with me. Thank you for being my friend. And the other group of people and one person in particular is my blind canvas family and Una. You guys are the best thing about YouTube and if I had to go back in time and do it all again, you're the only reason I would do it all again is because I get to have you guys in my life. Thank you.